Our team coverage continues with our Oscar Marganis joining us live at a gymnastics academy in Burlington where a watch party was held. Oscar, what a moment for the women's USA Gymnastics team. So many role models there. Oscar, how did the little ones react to the win? Everybody over here at this gym here in Burlington, Brestians uh, to be exact, are on kind of cloud nine. They watched USA win that gold here today. And you have all the kiddos jumping as well right over here. You see them right about to jump, all inspired by Simone Biles and company, and even dreaming of one day winning gold for themselves. USA! Every jump followed by a chant. USA! And every flip by a cheer. These little gymnasts followed Women's Team USA to the last routine until winning gold, witnessing dreams coming true. The routines are really cool and challenging. I want to go to the Olympics someday. The acrobatics displayed by Simone Biles and company on the floor Tuesday, a vivid reminder of why gymnastics is so popular at the Olympics and among these girls. And I like just get to feel like flying. I like to challenge myself and do hard things. So like the adrenaline that it gives you and after you do a skill you just feel so happy and you're so proud of yourself after you work so hard for it. It's given 11-year-old Charlotte, who's had a few recent injuries, a reason to keep going. I feel like Suni is my role model because, like, she she was just sick, and like now, like you see her like really um, progressing very fast. And although most of these kids won't become Olympians, I kind of want to be one of them, but I mostly just want to go to college and do gymnastics in college. The sport is teaching them skills to succeed. It's just an amazing way to get body awareness and learn how to control yourself. For now, these young gymnasts are enjoying the spring in their jump, dreaming of what could be. They just get inspired to do more, to do better, to keep coming in the gym. Definitely inspiring for them to see a lot of the older athletes now, you know, women in their 20s and, and above instead of just young, young girls. So they, have, they can understand the length, the length they can compete. All right, back out live here at Brestian's gym where you see all these guys, again, like I said, inspired by what happened earlier today. Biles officially becoming the most decorated American gymnast in the history of the Olympic Games with eight medals already. And Team USA here has still another chance to keep adding to their collection later this week. And I'm just sitting on top of this because I definitely cannot do that and will not even attempt it. But I can dream about it, right? Reporting live in Burlington, Oscar Margain, NBC10 Boston. Oscar, I thought you could do a bad Backflip. What's going on? <laughs> I think there's some future Olympians there. Oscar, thank you. Our Bianca Beltran will be bringing us live reports throughout the Paris Games, including tonight at 11. She will have exclusive reaction from our New England rugby players and their families. That's right here on NBC10 Boston, your exclusive home of the 2024 Paris Olympic Games. Can't wait.